Hello my friends and welcome back to Holistic Living Down Under. This weekend we are heading out camping in our vintage 1975 caravan and I've needed to do some shopping to fill up the pantries and uh, the fridge. So let's have a look at what we got. So I went to our local fruit and veggie store uh, as well as the butcher and there I got, as well as Aldi actually, and at Aldi I got the washed potatoes. And they just happened to end up with the rest of my fruit and vegetables. Um, I also got some tomatoes because we go through those a lot. More tomatoes. So I got these two punnets of cherry tomatoes because they were cheap. Um, I also got these little snack carrots because, well, some healthy snacks at least. Um, just got a bunch of spring onions which I like to put in my salads. Um, then I grabbed some avocados. Um, I tried to get them sort of different stages of ripeness, but yeah. I got a lemon and a lime because, again, I like to squeeze those in my salads. Then I got this bag of um, just mixed baby lettuce leaves. Um, I just like sometimes, especially if you're away, just to make a quick salad is just easier than buying individual things. I got a bag of smaller pink lady apples as well as these ginormous ones um, they were slightly different price but I'll use the big ones for some cooking and some quick salads that I've um that I'm going to do while we're away camping so that's why I got two different bags of those then I got these little tomatoes just different colored um cherry tomatoes that just look really nice then I got um this little camembert cheese um, which is a local one to us in Adelaide Hills I also got this bag of beetroot which I love in salads I got some grapes because they happen to be on special as well as some pears and I've happened to lose one pear already because my three-year-old has <laughs> managed to take one so we went from four down to three then I went to the butcher just to get some barbecue meat for one of the days when we we're away. So I got this um, chicken, marinated chicken, um, for the two older kids, um, as well as some pork spare ribs that also been marinated. Um, I also got these, well, they're called chiraptor cheese here in Australia. I don't know if that's a universal name anywhere, but it's, they're sort of like skinless sausages, um, almost like burger meat like in a sausage, sausage shape and here are all my stuff from Aldi so I'm going to go ahead and pack away all of this um, fresh produce and we will um, I'll see you again with all of my Aldi stuff oh my dear so this is the damage that we ended up with um, unfortunately when we go camping we have a very small fridge so a lot of the stuff that I buy have to go in cupboards and everything which means I have to buy more packaged stuff than what I would usually do anyway I started with some corn thins that we got um, I also got some macadamias because I like to snack on those at least I got some sort of keto healthy snacks um, I just got some organic pasta spirals um, I also got this big bag of popcorn that's got um, I think it's got about 10 of these little ones inside of them but it's already ended up inside the caravan so I only had this one left and um, then I got some ham because I thought I'd make um, the family some pizzas tonight um, and then I have some organic spaghettis it's just handy to have in the pantry at home so when we get back we have some quick dinners i got this shortcut bacon as well it's just handy because we're going to have a small barbecue there so at least they will fit then i got this big pack of beef mince what i do with these is that i cut them into quarters and then i freeze um each one in portions then i also got some gouda cheese that i'm going to bring for camping i got some pork mince which is for probably one of the days when we get back so i'm going to put that in the freezer to make some pork dumplings then i've got these chicken breast schnitzels that we're going to have on the first night when we're away and they had chicken on special at aldi so i got this big pack of chicken that i can portion up and put in the freezer because it's one of the few things my oldest will eat um 
I mentioned that our fridge in the caravan is really small, so the, that means the space in the door is quite small as well. So I got two of these one litre milks because they will fit nicely in the door and then just normal two litre one for our fridge at home. Then I got some more tomato paste, so we're going to use that for pizzas tonight as well as probably some bolognese or something next week. Um, I saw these golden kiwi fruits that looked interesting. Then I also got another bag of carrots. Um, I got some chips and um, we got one of those turbo ovens in the caravan so I'm going to just do some um, chicken schnitzels and chips for the first night for the boys. Um, then I bought some chocolates. Um, I haven't tried that salted almond and honey one yet but I like these um, dark chocolate and coconut and they're portioned out into five portions so that makes it nice and handy. Um, then I got these... Um, just sort of soup dumplings um, at the back. I thought I'd put that in the freezer and just have when I have um, uh, like chicken broth and stuff. Um, and I also got some triple brie cheese because my husband really liked that. Um, for my middle son, he likes these yogurts to take to school. So I bought that for school snacks for him. Um, then I got these two packet of organic baked beans and we'll take one camping with us I think and then just save the other one some um, pizza shredded cheese for tonight and two packs of organic salted butter and then I got this avocado dip I haven't tried it yet but I thought hey why not um, and here is my splurge for today I love smoked salmon and this particular one is uh, a Scandinavian one as well which I really, really enjoy. So when they were special, I thought I'd get it. I got these seaweed crackers. Um, and my kids like these and they usually take it with a little bit of cheese in for the school. And I got these um, dried cranberries. Then I got this, um, it's like a chocolate drink, malted chocolate drink. So we're gonna bring that one out into the caravan for like warm up milk and have that for like hot chocolates. Um, then I got some smooth natural peanut butter for my youngest one who likes that as well as some strawberry jam this one's actually quite nice um then i got some um little tuna so this is like a mango chili and my middle one middle son he likes these to take to school and then i got these ones they're like i think they're like a german treat um and i can remember having it when i was like really young and so i thought i'd let the kids try it while we're camping and I just got some a couple of bags of chips I got this Thai chili lime as well as the sea salt one I just have to disclaim that we are camping away with the in-laws as well so it's not just us so we will be sharing all of this um then I got some um salmon this canned salmon I sometimes put this on a salad if I can't get fresh then I got these double times um just to have for like movie night lollies and stuff. I got some protein bars for my oldest son to take to school. Um, chocolate hazelnut spread, which is like generic Nutella. Eating crackers, which is like your Jats or your Ritz crackers. And then these little rice cracker snacks, which are great to put in your school lunchbox. And um, I also found this fridge mat that they had in special buys and um, that you, you can cut it to size and put down the bottom of your fridge. And it's meant to keep your fruit and vegetables last a bit longer so I thought I'd test that out and just see if that helps then I got some bananas and see if we can go through those and I got some arnott shapes again just handy snacks because the kids will be out I saw these cute little books and I thought my little three-year-old might like like those when we're camping Again, I got some uh, brekkie bis um, bickies, which my older son can take and put in his locker at school. <laughs> and my grapes have already been attacked, as you can see. Then I got this packet of mandarins, uh, because again, my older son, he really loves mandarins. So I thought we'd do those. And I actually forgot to say about the mini chicken, um, mini brown rice crackers, not chicken, at the back there as well. And yeah, that's the that's the damage. So a lot of this is now going to go out into the caravan. And I'm just going to pack away the rest into the fridge, the freezer and the pantry here. So that's what I had for you today. I thought I might also show you just quickly what I'm going to do with that 
mat so there's our veggie drawer so i've cut the mat to size and put it in and then i'm going to put all my vegetables on top like this and hopefully that will make them last a bit longer so i hope you enjoyed my little grocery haul today um a little bit more unhealthy than what i'm used to but when you have a limited fridge space you do what you can i hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and I will see you again next time.